Well, hello there. I know I said I was just going to take a little break, but I ended up quitting. Because I was so sick from the plane right here. I mean, it wasn't really that bad. It pretty much went away as soon as I stopped flying really shitty. But still, it made me not feel like playing anymore right then. But now we are back. We just bought ourselves our very own lovely hangar. And I think we can make... I don't know if these are bonus missions or if they increase the value of our hangar or what they are, but I'm trying it out. See what it is. So let's do it. So I'm sitting in a go-kart with nowhere to go. That's an all-terrain vehicle fitted with GPS tracking system, CB radio. That'd be the radio we're talking on, Matt. We use this to pick up the shipment. There's a plane making the drop soon near a mobile home off East Joshua Road. Make it fast. Those rednecks have been sniffing around. I think you'll find rural American is the politically correct term. And I think the cops got eyes on us, so try to avoid the main roads. Is there anyone who oh, doesn't shit. know about this? That's not good. Can't use the main roads. That is my Achilles heel right there. I am all about main roads and GPS markers and plotted out routes and shit. Anytime you ask me to go off roading, asking for trouble. So, can I use the main roads now? Now that I got the package? Yeah, I'm not even gonna risk it. I'm just gonna go back through the cornfields of doom. Besides, it's not like it was that far of a car ride or anything. It was surprisingly, surprisingly short ride. So, you know. I mean, knowing my luck, chances are I'll end up flipping over and landing on my head and dying at some point, but. Oh well. Aw, oh, I can't. What? Impenetrable sticker bushes. Ain't that some bullshit? Oh dear. <laughs> Lord Almighty. Me and this vehicle ain't getting along too well. Oh well, mission complete. Give me my bonus monies or whatever it is. What I get? Time 154, total earned, five grand. I collected a pistol. Okay. Does that actually count? I remember before I quit, they said something about doing missions or jobs or something to increase the value of your property that you buy. So I'm not sure if that counts or not. Um, I don't know, maybe I should try this plain one just because. Just because I'm a dumbass and I feel like making myself seasick again as soon as I start playing again. Sounds like a brilliant plan to me. Sound brilliant to anybody else? Oscar! Tango, Foxtrot, Whiskey! Oscar! Hey, oh, you're on the edge. I like that, I think. Okay, that plane is this custom fitted for package drops. State of the art radar, secure radio. It's tricked out, man. Really? Because it looks like it was made by a child for a school project. You're just a typical classic light aircraft enthusiast enjoying his midlife crisis. No profile. My middle name. Okay, radar's working. You're up on the screen here. We got two deliveries. I put in the coordinates, you make the drops, you get out of there. Easy. Roger. Oscar. Trevor. Deliver arms packages to the drop-off locations. And how far away are these goddamned locations? I'm just praying I don't have to do some sort of... Targets are marked with a flare. Some sort of super epic awesome pickup maneuver to pick them up because this when approaching a drop location the radar will indicate the drop zone range drop a baggage within the area for a successful delivery yeah I'm nowhere near being close to dropping this shit off dude so don't really need your tutorial quite yet unless these are the drop 
buff zone. Oh, these are the draw. I already. Oh, nice. I don't have to do anything. I already got the packages in the plane. I just have to drop the shit off. Oh, goddamn. Lucky me. Oh, yeah, that was beautiful, baby. As long as I don't make myself sick flying this plane, it is a victory in my book. This plane's got some serious turbulence issues. Doesn't even look like it's that goddamn windy out, but man, you sit there flying for a while and run into some sort of invisible wind stream or something and sits there rocking your plane back and forth and shit. Yeah, I would say I am much better at controlling this shit now that I've flown it a little bit. Still one shitty ass plane in my opinion, but you know. Is that my next location that I see with the smoky in the sky? Well, I did that first one perfectly, so there's no reason to doubt myself on this one, right? Everything shall go off without a hitch. And... Yeah! Now you're gonna make me fly all the way back to the airfield. Not a clue. I learned everything I know from some lovely ladies just south of the border. Ah, okay. How long have you been up here anyway? You seem to know your way around. Maybe five years on and off. I pretty much stay north now. Too much competition. I have to stay visible. And you? I mean, even I know that ain't a San Andrean accent. Sandy Shores, few years, self-destructive right-wing misfits, math, guns, incest, closest I could find to the Midwest. Can I pull up my, my landing gear? Maybe that's why I'm flying so shittily. If I remember correctly, there's some sort of fancy way to pull up your landing gears, but... Oh well, too late for that shit now. Oh my god, what a beautiful landing. How in the hell did I pull that off? Better not to question it. Just accept it. And be done. Air trafficking. Ooh, I got $125 accurate drop bonus. Time bonus, no time bonus, but I don't really care. Really, I think I did that pretty efficiently as far as time goes, but not according to them. Really don't see how I could have done that much quicker. Flew straight to that drop, and then straight to the other drop, and, and straight back. I mean, really. Yeah, I don't see anything else as far as missions go, so. Even though there's a big orange icon staring me right in the face on my map. Alrighty, what do we have to do now? We have a stranger or freak and a Chinese man. China man. Actually, I remember accidentally stumbling upon the uh The hell is it called? Like Oh yeah, the Bail Bonds missions. So. I accidentally went on here, and it turns out that is not the entire email. If you go down, you get a nice little mugshot, and you go down further, and they actually give you a picture of the last known location. So now we shall have to find that on our mappy dappy. Ah, see, I didn't even think about that though. 
because I haven't explored everywhere, I probably don't even have that location on my map -a -dappy. I mean, and I can almost guarantee you it would be out here somewhere in the hills. But you never know. So yeah, I guess... I guess I will not be doing that right now because I have no idea where to go because I, I, I do not have a full-on map. Well, I'm kind of disappointed now. I really wanted to try a bail bond mission now that I accidentally figured out how to do it. Because I was so clueless when I first got that email. She's just like, oh yeah, dude's like lo last seen in the quarry area. And I'm like, where's the quarry and stuff? And yeah, I don't know. Maybe if I paid attention to the road signs or something like that, then, then I could find them. Even though I don't have my map filled out. But ain't nobody got time for that shit. I'd rather just drive around and do missions and hopefully fill out my map enough that eventually I find the correct area. Ooh, breaking news! Yeah, that's my meth lab. Catch my bloody shootout. I'm so proud of myself making the news. <laughs> with Chicano gang the Aztecas at the Ace Liquor Store in Sandy Shores, which is an alleged front for a methamphetamine manufacturing operation. A reporter spoke to this man at the scene. It was terrifying. I was really scared that it would affect the street price of crystal. I love smoking crystal. <laughs> Could facades monopoly of the global operating oh, system? What was uh -oh. that? Hi there, Cletus. Hey, bud. You my new What's best friend? Nothing. What you yeah. up to, uh, hunting, hunting, hunting what? Retirees? Nah, just stuff. Windows, antenna, tires. <laughs> Herman. Ah, so that was you. Is the season for it? I don't give a shit about no season. <laughs> oh, good, huh? Don't let the regulations get you down. That's what I'm saying. Hey, hey, hey. You want to come hunting with me? It'd be real neighborly of you. Hell, why not? All right then. I'm here with you. Oh, I ain't got nothing else to do, I reckon. Might will hunt me some antenna and windows and whatnot. I got just a thing. Let's raise some hell, neighbor. All righty then. Oh, I'm in. I'll introduce you to one of my all-time favorite pastimes. <laughs> You're gonna love this. I'm sure I will. Okay. You see them three big satellite dishes? A I dish sure don't. Go down easier than a whore's drawers. You're a real pillar of the community. Yeah, that's it. Give him hell. Shoot another one. Isn't there another one over there? God damn American flag, get out of my way. Didn't I tell you this would be more fun than a barrel full of pussies? Oh, you're a classy day, Cletus. <laughs> no denying that. <laughs> now drive us up to that abandoned motel. I got an even better idea. How about you drive us up to that abandoned motel? I'm stealing your car. Hope that's okay. Hope it's a two-seater. Drives like a dream. Apparently, he wanted me to steal his car. Try our luck on something less stationary. Oh, that's not good for me. Liberals? Nothing as slippery as that. You'll see. You've got way too much time on your hands. Nah, this is just a bit of foolery. I've been busier than hell with the real hunting. The money and wild organic meat these days, you wouldn't believe. Them hipsters will give you their parents' last dime for it. It's gotten so I can't even keep up with the demand no more. All this eat local, small batch, farm to table bullshit. You know, I could maybe use another pair of hands if I can get you up to snuff with that rifle. You keep on criticizing my shooting, you'll be starring in a snuff with that rifle. Well, that's just disgusting. Here we are. I bet you never shut out the tires on a car before. Oh, well, by be golly, I sure have. See what you got then? Ain't you gonna shoot anything, Cletus? 
Nah, I do this all the time, and I want to see how you deal with a moving target. Not hot well at all. This is perfect right here. Pick a car and shoot a tire. Good plain old fishing. Unless, of course, I can lock onto my target. I am not good at moving targets. Yeah, I'm trying my hardest. Don't actually know where the fuck to aim. You, you stop driving fast, goddammit, and let me shoot your tire. You son of a bitch. Okay, there's some nice big juicy tires for me to shoot. Or not. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> oh yeah, I warned you. That's said I wasn't. Can I just like shoot some wildlife? Like, oh, I saw some out there, but he disappeared. How did that not hit the tire? That's a bullshit. I saw like a little spark like right where the damn tire is. Son of a bitch. <laughs> we is gonna be here for a while, I reckon. Oh my god, I got one. That's it, beauty. Holy shit. What the hell does it look like I'm doing you? Oh my god, nice. Hell yeah. Then shut that bitch from a mile away. Uh, oh, I got that one? Oh, hot damn. I told you I wasn't so good at them moving targets. I don't know. popular guys in town. <laughs> Am I glad I ran into you? <laughs> yeah. I know we're near this fun being antisocial on your own. Whatever cranks your tractor, I say. What's up next on the hillbilly anarchist agenda? Ever shot anything in the face? Actually, let me ask it again. Ever shot anything in the face on four legs? I just now, did. It's important you realize I'm a man plagued by vicious rumors. Fine. Let's head for the roof. I seen some coyotes hanging around down by the road. Reckon it would be real neighborly of us to get rid of a couple. And we are nothing if not neighborly. I am so not a neighborly kind of fella. Kind of funny how he asked if I ever shot anything with a face on four legs before right after I shot myself my very own rat. Don't even try. Really? What I if I do? Speeds. Oh, on, I can't. Off, and don't push your luck. You want to talk some shit? Shoot you in the back of the head, except it won't let me. God damn it. Khalid is the slack jawed yokel. Alright, I see him. No look it up. Pew. Sing to me and now, pew. Dog, and, another. and pew. Nice. Three for three. Holy yes. shit. I reckon you should tag along next time I go hunting out at Polito Bay. I'll show you how to bag an elk. Eh, why not? All right. Gotta go. I'll send you a text when I'm about. Yeah, it's quite all right. No, no need to send me any kind of text. This is... Two for one, pop, pop, 15%, and bad signal, three out of three. Can it assume pop, pop was uh, just my tire shooting percentage, which of course sucked all kinds of butthole. But we all knew that was going to happen. Uh, can I borrow your vehicle? Come back, goddammit. You suck. Son of a bitch. Come back here and let me borrow your vehicle. And by borrow, I mean steal and crash and do all kinds of mischief with until it blows up. Yes. But I will be sure to bring it back to you. Fingers crossed. Bike. Yeah, give me that fucking bike. Yeah. Oh, man. Almost beat the train. Oh my god, now I have to wait for- Oh shit, he's coming to fuck me up. <laughs> that was some bad timing with that train. 